Let smiles have in their hearts, I fear, millions of mischiefs.
my heart is thirsty for that noble pleasure. I cannot drink too much of Bruce's love. And to our work. Mark Antony and young Octavius have gathered a mighty power and mean to bend their expedition toward Philippi. What say you of marching to Philippi presently? I do not think he could. Your reason? Well, this is it. It is evident the enemy seek us, doing the self defense, whilst we, lying still, are full of rest, defense, and nimbleness. Good reasons must be forced to better. Our cause is right. Our legions are brimful. The enemy increases every day. Well, we are right and ready to decline. There is a time in the affairs of men which, taken as a flood, leads on to fortune. Admitted, all the voyages of our lives are now shallows and miseries. Such a sea are we now afloat, and we must take the current or lose our ventures. Well, then, we here will go on. We'll allow ourselves to meet with the flow high. There's nothing more to say? No more. Good night. Early tomorrow we'll rise and dance. Where was I? It's not the page turned down where I left the reading. Ah, there it is. Ooh, this keeper burns. Ah! What falls? What are you that makes my blood run cold and my hair to stare? I thought some god? Some angel? Some devil? Speak to me what thou art! Thy evil spirit, my God. I come to that. To tell me as to meet me at Philippi. To see thee again. Ah, Philippi. Then I shall see thee there. Spirit. Now that I've taken heart, revenge. A little spirit, I would have more words with you. 